Live. I'm Froggy. And I'm Little Froggy. And you are watching YouTube Live with the Froggies. Ooh, the camera's on this tight today, so I'll actually be looking in the right place. All right, so uh, this week, <laughs> we're going to be talking about our favorite vid. We're going to have open some fan mail. <laughs> we're going to have fun with Pop Pops. Uh, Pop Pop Hair Surprise. And we'd like to give a special thanks to MGA for sending this to us as a gift. They will do a question and answer, talk about an Instagram giveaway, and at the very end, we'll do as many shout outs as we can. Are you ready? Yep. So, actually, first up is special announcements. Today is a very special day because the premiere of D3 is tonight, which is Dissidents 3, airing on the Disney Channel. Um, I'm just gonna wait till it's on uh, iTunes. iTunes, yeah. So that's when I watch it. And also today was also when uh, Shira season three launched today as well. So lots of stuff to watch over the weekend. We can totally binge watch sitting on the couch. Sounds like a plan. Yeah. Well, in between going to the barn. Yeah. Okay. Up next is favorite vid. What was your favorite vid this week? My favorite video this week was BTS. Ha! <laughs> surprise! Surprise! Yes, BTS was awesome, and I really I got a chance to give our stage a makeover, which was a plus. I am going to start giving a lot of our rooms makeovers or redoing some of them because is it on Netflix? Um, what D three or Shira? Shira is on Netflix. D three I don't know if it's on Netflix. I think it might air later. It's actually probably most likely not. It's probably gonna be on iTunes first, and, and then, then on Disney stream. And then streaming Disney stream, yeah, streaming service. So I'm gonna wait for it hits iTunes, and then I get to watch it. Um, what was I saying? Oh yes, BTS video this week was a lot of fun. I was not really happy that I pre-ordered the dolls and then found them in the store before they were delivered to my house. <laughs> that part was not the best. Um, but I was really happy to find all of them and we got the video out and gave them a stage So that was fun. My favorite video this week was definitely a fab some horses. We were in New York We went to two different barns uh, Love to Jamaica. What's up? We went to two different barns and we walked around New York answering questions about ourselves So that was a really fun video to make Walking around New York is always fun to me. What about you? What's the question? Do you enjoy walking around New York? Yeah, for the most part it's actually like, I, I like um I don't really like walking around at night. Yeah. Well, I don't. Like, I, I just don't like being out at night. Yeah, I'm like uh, yeah, same here. But um, we were at Sweet Sweet in New York, and I got sick, like crazy sick. So that wasn't fun. Yeah, wasn't happy about that. Uh, what that question is? Are you a unicorn? <laughs> no. Or am I? All right. The next thing is fan mail. All right, we have a lovely little letter here. And hello, UK! Awesome that you're joining us tonight. Isn't it like midnight there? I mean, I don't know, it's pretty late, isn't it? In the UK. Yeah, it's midnight. What? Oh, we have some stuff in here. You check that out and show everybody and I'll read the letter. Hi, Froggy, my sister and I love your videos. Whenever there is a rainy or snow day, we always go and watch your videos and make something. We like how you make little mini edible food. When we first started watching YouTube, your channel was the only one we watched. Oh, um, my sister and I like horseback riding, oh, dance, drawing, and crafting. We like all those things. I love dancing. I'm just really bad at it. Um, we have only one request. Could you make a doll Chick-fil-A? Well, we do have Chick-fil-A food out there, so I guess we could make a Chick-fil-A. Thank you for helping us not be bored. <laughs> happy crafting, happy crafting. Khadija and Asaya, and my sister sent you fan mail a year ago. Did I get to it? <laughs> I'm so sorry if I hadn't got to it yet. Uh, we are going through our fan mail, but thank you for sending this to us, and we're so happy that we found uh, your fan mail this time. So, oh, that's awesome. I love the skirt. What's up to Khadija and, uh, what was the other name? Asaya. What's up? Okay. Up next is Pop Pop Hair Surprise. Someone says do more Star Stable. I did another Star Stable video. Uh, I just didn't get it edited. All right, so we would like to give a special thanks to MGA for sending this to us as a gift. So Pop Pop Hair Surprise is a brand new toy launching this fall. I'm gonna oh, open this up for us. While you're making all those crackling sounds, I will talk. 
All right, it's three in one pop pets. Pop hair surprises, all about surprises that pop. Hair you can wear, share, and style, and all new hilarious, I'm saying that wrong, hair hilarious characters. Each pop pop hair surprise comes with three in one pop pets, a brush, a roller, I'm sorry, one pop brush, one roller, one pop hair pet, and there are over 25 characters to collect. Are you doing this on purpose? No. Like trying to be as loud as possible? Okay. <laughs> you can find the ultra rare twins, uh, Harry Kate and Brushley. I guess it's like Harry Kate and Ashley. Or Kelly Clipper and uh, the rare pop roller. Okay. So. I think this was supposed to pop open, but I think we kind of opened it already. So it says pull the tab and this is supposed to pop open. Oh, well, yeah. Okay, so there was the popping mechanism. So here, let's let's pop this. Here we go. Pop pop hair surprise! Yeah. Okay, so pop pop hair surprise. Inside we have these little characters. Wow, okay, so they are like little brush people. You see that? Oh wow. Yeah. They had names, and we kind of moved it. Okay, so once Girly Cues, Disco Doos, Pretty in Pink, and then Bedheads. See, all the little names in this cute little display, which we totally failed at opening. That happened. You got um, scissors? Scissors. Uh, what do you want the next Darby show to be? I am working on it right now. I just didn't finish, so as soon as I finish it, it will go up. It's a surprise. You know, we never tell you what's happening in the Darby show until it comes out. Ow. What? Seriously? Plastic. Sure. Always have adult supervision when working with sharp objects. I'm going to keep these over here. <laughs> zip no. Yeah, I need them. No, you don't There's get scissors. Ties. You need child-proof scissors. Okay. <laughs> so, um, let's see. What is this? Mine is... You wear and share eight ways to play, spray, pop, unroll, brush, style, wear, share, pencil topper, and more. Three in one pets. It comes in a little plastic case like this. You see that? It's a cute little cat like creature. No, it's not a cat. It's like a bear. Is it a bear? It has like bear ears. So I'm going to say it's a bear. Okay. I'm trying to open it, and I do need scissors to open. Always have adult supervision. We're working with sharp objects. Here we go. And there's a little zip tie on the side here holding it in place. Does that zip tie stay there? You had to cut it. Oh, I got this thing. Oh, it looks like a... What are those gum things called when they roll up? A, um, I don't know. Gum wheel thingies. Oh, like that fruit by the foot? No. no. Or um, the gum by the foot? Gum? No, it's literally gum, gum. by the yard. Is that what it's called? I don't know. I don't eat candy. <laughs> Do you like pickles? Uh, no. You? Pickles? Yes. Depends on the pickle. Depends on the pickle. Okay. So here, uh, thank you. I like my hoop earrings. So here's a little pop pop pet. She's got some big sparkly eyes there. The back is a brush, but you know, rocking the natural hair, and I'm not gonna brush it because it'll jack up my curls. And then we open it up. All oh, their hair ties. We open it up. Did you? Are you showing them the unboxing, or you're just over there doing it on your own? Okay. So inside, I got a little bag here, and I gotta pull the string. How did you get it open? Did you cut the string? Yeah, I cut it. All right, I'm gonna cut the string. You're gonna hit me with that, aren't you? Well, that's cool. I like the little cloth here. What is the cloth for? It's got like elastic on it. What are you supposed know. to do with this? We need to read the instructions. Okay, new intro, because it's annoying. Oh, I actually love our intro. I love my intro, so. Um, you stand up to watch and it's 1 a.m. ZZ stop motion. Thank you so much. Whoa. Okay, and so here is, oh yeah, the hair rolls out. I don't know what I do with this part yet. And, whoa, okay, that opens. And the little pet popped out. And here it is, it's like a cat with a mohawk and a lot of hair. Now we're supposed to wear this. You can put this in your hair and have fun. So here, you got the little hair piece going on here. Uh, and there we go. 
know, I need curly because uh, I don't think I can rock the straight hair. Look, what do you think? No? Uh, you know. But now I can brush it. That's all I know. Okay, but now I can brush it, see? Oh! Are they all the same? I feel like I'm ready for descendants, y'all. I got my descendants hair going on. Gotta have that wild, crazy hair color. Went to Dizzy. She did this weird bang thing in the front. I'm rocking it. Oh, they're all the same thing. What? All these bangs are the same. I think it was of different hair textures, right? No. No? no. Yeah, it says different hair types. Curly, two-tone, and rainbow hair. So there is a curly out there. There's little tiny barrettes. You see the little barrettes? Okay. And see? It's like a lightning bolt barrette. And there's little rubber bands, which I would get stuck in my hair. But you can always put them in their hair. And I don't know what this is. Is this just a, just a, plus a I don't, do you see instructions? I didn't get any curly hair. Maybe it's just one. Pop, pop, pads. And what is this part? What does this one do? What do they say the curly hair looks Oh, this like? is the roller. This is the roller. This is going in my face. Okay. Uh, what is the next question? Oh, yes. So, once again, we like to give a very special thanks to MGA for sending Pop Pop Hair Surprise to us so we can uh, add some color to our do. Yeah, what do you think? Oh, I can add more than one. Oh, this is Mal hair, y'all, right? The purple and pink, even though this season is pretty much blue and purple. But yeah, all right, let's do that. Let's throw the Mal hair in here. And you know, if you really wanted to curl it, you could just uh, roller set it and add a little hot water and you can make it curl it. Okay, yeah. <laughs> so how is that looking? We have more than one here. I have two pop pop pets. And there, if I had like straight hair, they would totally like blend in, like give me some really cool bangs. But with the curly hair, it's just kind of weird. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Hubba, hubba, bubba gum. Thank you, Shannon. Oh, that's other, yeah, that's it. That's what it's called. Hubba, bubba. How do you know that? I'm getting hair all over my face. What do you mean? Like, how, does, how, does, how do you remember that it's hubba, bubba gum? Because we don't know because we don't use it. I'm so, I've deprived my children of, like, most of um, candy and stuff. So we don't know. We would totally fail a Jeopardy or a trivia game talking about candy. I know what a Snickers is, but my son's allergic to peanuts, so, you know. Snickers doesn't have peanuts in it. Snickers does have peanuts in it. It does? I think it's like a nougat with peanuts and caramel, and then there's covered in Maybe chocolate. This is rainbow. Aren't they? Isn't St. Clair already over here? Uh, I think they're all the same. I don't think so, because our characters are the same. Our characters no, are slightly characters. different. See, like, they got, like... <laughs> Oh, yeah, that just happened. You just pull your earring out of your... Ooh, what's that look like? Uh, but the good thing they're easy latch earrings because that happens quite often. Yes. Okay, up next is questions and answers. First up, we like to... Oh, what am I doing? All right. Can you make a car garage shop? Like, a, like just a garage or you want a place where people would take their car to get it repaired because we can do that or we can just do a garage or we can do someone who repairs uh what in the world okay <laughs> or we can do uh, uh someone who repairs cars at their house oh is that the curly maybe is that supposed to be curly i think that's the curly this one doesn't have as much hair as the yeah. other ones oh i'm supposed to add this to my hair too yeah why don't you add one to your hair you can do it. No, no, no. no, no come on. I got like three in right now. Yeah. These pets are having a party here. You need numbers. I don't know. <laughs> I'm always the person who has to get all this stuff done. Yes, we can definitely do a car garage. We've been talking about wanting to do something. What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> stop, stop. No. We've been talking. You're getting entangled. Okay. We've been wanting to do like a gas station and... <laughs> Did you just rewind it? Yeah. <laughs> You're the worst. We want to do a gas station and, and some other things. So, yeah, give me some time and I'll do my best to make that happen. Um, I am not ignoring you, Ava. I see you. I'm trying my best. Okay, uh, unicorn shirt shout out. Unicorn shirt. What's, What's up? up? <laughs> All right, well, how was the first day of high school, little froggy? It was really boring. Like, really boring. High school, honestly, like, 
it's definitely important and like do well and all that because like gpa and everything like for college that that's where everything like starts and whatnot but like social wise and like oh personally like my personal experience i didn't meet anyone new <laughs> so i mean i did meet some new people like i saw some new people in my classes but i didn't like make any friends because i already knew a lot of people oh so you you, you you had people to talk to you just didn't make new friends yeah but okay. i really expected to like make me friends but so i did it's, like it's like high is middle school but just on a different well, campus but the one thing is that i don't really hang out with the same group that i mean i do but like it's it's kind of like i have different friends than the friends that i had last year but they were still my friends so Okay, so high school was pretty easy. You it was no problem. It's not easy. It's no, I'm not saying like easy. the first day. You, you made first it through. Day, it's you survived. Really boring. It's really boring. And it was the... School is cool. Stay in school. Do yeah, not stay listen school, to that one. But it was really boring. <laughs> school. Like the campus, that, the school I go to has a huge campus. And I literally just try not to get lost. So don't talk to this one if you're looking for school advice. Um, yeah. What do you mean? Because <laughs> you're just like, it's awful. I didn't meet anyone. I do have all yeah, honors man. classes, like two college and AP classes, though, so, you know. School is going to be awesome. It's only been, like, two days. Give us some time. Uh, you know, high school is a learning experience, and you're going to do all kinds of amazing things. Just give it some time and get into the groove, and everything will be good. Hope okay. Because so. this week <laughs> was really slow. Uh, can you make a little froggy doll? We are working on that idea. Um, what are the craft projects that you no longer have? Quite a few. I no longer have Elsa's castle or Elsa's palace. Um, I no longer have a lot of the uh, movie theater. We've kind of just kept pieces of it and we put it on to the, to the set when we're making a video for that. So a lot of times either they've been damaged. I don't have the courtyard anymore. So a lot of times they get damaged or they're just, I run out of space and I have to pick and choose because I'm constantly creating new things. So sometimes things have to go. And uh, yeah, that's what happens. Um, do you have any sewing machine tips and tricks? Well, everyone's sewing machine is different. So I have a very inexpensive sewing machine that I bought from Walmart for like $89 about 10 years ago. And it's still kicking. I love that sewing machine. And mine's really easy to use. Um, my mom has a big, fancy, expensive one, which I don't know how to use because she took a class and everything. So if you need to know how to use your sewing machine, and if you bought it from places like, uh, I think, Joann's or whatnot, they do classes and teach you how to use your machine. Otherwise, I would just YouTube it. And if you like for me to let you know how I may use my machine, I'll be happy to do a video on my machine, but it's, like, really old and inexpensive. But it was a great starter machine, and I just never upgraded so... Um, can you make a candy room? Well, absolutely yes. And we already have a Vanellope Von Sweets room, a fangirl, and we did Candy Topia. So there are two candy inspired rooms already floating out there on YouTube. Uh, next question is, are you going to watch D3 tonight? If it's on iTunes, I will watch it tonight. Otherwise, I just have to wait for them to upload it. Uh, what are your passions other than crafting and doll collecting? Hmm? What are your um, passions other than... I like drawing. Drawing. Okay. Is that considered... No, it's not considered crafting. Yeah, okay, drawing. I do draw in my free time. I like to draw me and her as uh, doll characters. So if you go to our Instagram, I've drawn us as Monster High dolls. I've drawn us as um, Mabel-ish type people. I guess cartoons, too. So I've drawn us as Mabel from uh, Mabel Pines from Gravity Falls. What else have I done? Oh, I've done hair adorables. If we were in a hair adorables world... And right now, I'm working on us as LOL Surprise dolls, like the babies. But it just takes a, t a lot of time, and I just work on them slowly, so I don't post it often. I also love horses. I love going to the barn and hanging out with Johnny and stuff like that. Yeah, I like horses, too. <laughs> don't sound so excited. <laughs> um, can you make a unicorn outfit? Sure, why not? We can definitely see what we can do. But until we get to that video, we do have a unicorn onesie and a unicorn video where we make like the horn and we have like the body like to make like a centaur unicorn person. So those videos are out there on YouTube right now. Someone said, what is your favorite thing at Starbucks? I like the passion tea with no sugar. I honestly like to be honest, my favorite thing I'm glad you like to be honest. Uh, uh, is, <laughs> my favorite thing is uh, the iced chai tea with almond milk. 
and extra sweetener, but I like don't eat <laughs> sugar, so I can't get that anymore. <laughs> so she's, so I just drink the fashion tea now. As soon as she moves out, she's gonna buy like a bag of sugar and just like ah. I am not gonna do that. <laughs> it's like candy, candy. She's gonna have her own dream topia. No, candy topia in her house. You can like eat the walls. <laughs> just like mother deprived me of sugar. Someone said do more I R L. In real life. Oh, you like that. You like that. Yeah, um, well, as for Little Froggy doing craft videos, I am a firm believer in not making children do videos unless they want to. So she's allowed to come in and go as she pleases. So that was a real big treat for me as well, that she wanted to be a part of that video. I will gladly have her come on the videos whenever she likes, but it's really up to her what she wants to do and if she has time, because you're pretty busy. You're in high school now, you have courses, after school activities. So when we see her showing the videos, it's like a treat. Look forward to it. And you never know what's going to happen. So you got to watch like every one of her videos. So, so someone said that they were starting eighth grade on the 29th and they wanted tips from me. I don't know why you want tips from me because I like, you know. You, you got straight A's, dude. Barely. <laughs> but, uh, uh, yeah, barely straight A's. So, but <laughs> I mean, I have like good. 200s in like two of my classes, but you know, barely. So. Uh, <laughs> I barely got a hundred. <laughs> Honestly, I wonder was I like that in school because I was a straight A student and all I wanted to get was hundreds. Are hard to keep up. Like, oh my like, gosh, I only got a hundred and three in this class. No, it's like when you have a hundred and three and then you get hundreds on your stuff and then it keeps bringing the hundred and thirty down and you're like, what the heck? <laughs> but, <laughs> oh yeah, so tips in eighth grade. Um, let's see. So eighth grade was. The best year for me of middle school i looked eighth grade a lot i had really good teachers and i had really good friends and um yeah it was really cool um honestly like focus on school nothing else really matters um uh don't have drama because drama is stupid we don't use that word i mean it is though like honestly it's really unnecessary and i didn't have any drama eighth grade because i was like i'm just not gonna have drama so if you really don't want to have drama just don't I think that's the big thing that made it great for me. And another thing is, um, uh, don't get involved with like middle school relationships because, like, they don't matter. But uh, <laughs> okay, moving on. It's pretty much just great and make uh, it have fun. Can you make Sophie and Chloe a new kitchen? Yes, that is on our to-do list. Absolutely is. I just haven't got to it yet. This is like their third or fourth kitchen. Yeah. Um, <coughs> excuse me. She's so dying. Funny. I'm not going to drink water because I saw what happened last time I did that. Well, your voice is still <coughs> an octave. Dude. <coughs> okay. You're going to drink some water. Uh, okay. Don't just, spit just it up give me, <laughs> Just give me a second. Alright, we're just going to do it over here and hope I don't, like, spill it everywhere. Are you watching to see if I mess up? Yes. <laughs> Someone said, give me tips from middle school. Why do you want tips from... You know what I should actually do? You know what I should really do? I should do a first day of... Uh, high school tips because I remember it now and honestly it's not that hard just get your classes and get lost okay. do y'all like anime some I like my hair academia I like um one punch man <coughs> Jesus okay I'm still getting over my cold <laughs> I'm trying to still get over my cold um anime some anime is good are you planning traveling to other countries in the future yes as soon as we're better and not contagious. <laughs> Someone said, uh, what made you start listening to BTS? Her. <laughs> okay. Oh. Uh, yeah, I started listening to BTS because of her and because we had a lot of requests to do a room. And then after I listened to it several times, I absolutely loved it. But I still listen to a couple songs. Like, I listen to Idol and Boy With Love and <clears throat> some other ones, but I don't remember their names. Like, the Blood, one Sweat, in, and Tears. No, the one that's in English. Uh, I'm like, I know I'm the worst K-pop person. Wait, but did I just forget the name? It's, a uh, Wasted so, On Me. Wasted On Me. There you go. Yeah, I listened to that one, too. <clears throat> oh, yeah, I started listening to BTS. Um, I found them on YouTube. And I was like... Honestly, I was literally avoiding the videos because <laughs> I didn't want to like watch them for a while. But then I did watch them and I kind of got sucked in. And two years later, so <laughs> yeah. Oh. 
Um, what is just stop talking? What's your favorite color? <laughs> How are we gonna stop talking? But you didn't ask Wait, did they question. say what is just stop talking? No, it said stop. It said stop talking. Just stop talking. What's your favorite color? But if we can't talk, we can't tell you our favorite color. My favorite color is um. I don't know right now. Let's say uh, yellow. So, um, mine hasn't changed ever. I love wearing black. I love looking at green, and then my house is blue. That's my favorite. Can you do shoppy dolls on Ever After High? I can try. Shoppies have like, uh, their head shape is kind of different because their chins are so shallow that when you put it on a long neck, it looks really weird. And I do believe we've done it before. We put a Shoppie on a after high body once and everyone said it looked a draft. <laughs> so <laughs> it just it was an awkward experiment. But that video is out there and it just, it wasn't, I don't know. It's, I, I bet people could make it really cute. But my favorite combination was the Shoppie with the boxy girl body now that came out adorable put a shoppy head on a boxy girl body perfect got lots of fashion lots of accessory accessories and they look perfectly proportionate so i was like can you do a curly hair tip and like curly hair routine for our real hair yeah who oh. else's hair <laughs> i mean like doll hair i mean i don't know uh yeah we can uh i, I mean like a that'd be like a frog vlog type thing i guess yeah. i don't know if you all like care that much but i know about our hair but I mean, it's I can tell of, you what we do now. Yeah. I use a product. This is uh, melanin hair care. Then the oil. Yeah. This then is, water sometimes. I've recycled the jar and using it for lotion. But this is what the container looks like. And um, we use an oil, we use water, and we just twist it every night. A big, humongous twist. And then you take them out in the morning, run your fingers through it, and you just go. And it's good to go. Okay. Someone said sixth grade tips. Y'all are really asking for school tips. Like, I don't know. <laughs> That's like three years ago. <laughs> My brother's going to sixth grade though, so he already is in sixth grade. Oh yeah, he is. Isn't he? Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. And he's just kind of chill. Froggy boy is so chill. He just like yeah. I'm in sixth grade yeah. now. Sixth grade honestly I was it. pretty easy, and it's really easy, so you'll be fine. Well, <clears throat> I think easy is a relative term. Well, yeah, because if you're in ninth grade doing ninth grade math and you're just like, oh, sixth grade math is easy, but yeah, um, looking back at it now, honestly, right? the easiest math was seventh grade, like. Even like going from sixth grade to seventh grade, I was like, this math is easy. But I just think anytime you apply yourself, usually you'll be okay. And if you have problems, make sure you go to a parent or a teacher and ask for extra help. Tutoring is awesome. I was a tutor when I was in college, and I tutored lots and lots of people. And a lot yeah, of times and they just need someone afraid, sitting Don't with be them. afraid to be tutored because it's like it's not a bad thing. And the kids that like tease you about being tutored probably need tutors. So <laughs> I'm just saying, it's okay to ask for help. And, and, that's, and a lot of times the people that I tutored, they just needed someone to sit next to them. They knew what they were doing. It yeah. was just all about focus. But if you need a tutor, don't, if you need to come in early in class, like, don't be uh, ashamed or whatever, because just do what you gotta do to pass, so. When did the BTS dolls come out? They came out, like, this week and last week, I think. Um, they're in stores now. A lot of Targets are getting them. My Target uh, already has it, so you can look for them in stores right now. Okay. Uh, do you I like have a BTS the... bar bias? BTS bias. Do you like the Lord of the Rings? Uh, no. It's okay. I mean, the it's okay. You know, Gandalf and the Grey and all them, all them awesome people. Uh, I really liked Orlando Bloom back in the day, so that was interesting. Orlando Bloom. <laughs> yeah, I only he know was, him from Pirates of the He was the elf. He was the elf in Lord of the Rings. I'm not big on Lord of the Rings, to be honest. Yeah, I mean, it's cool. It's not for everyone. You know, but I like dragons and stuff like that, so I thought it was pretty interesting. I do like Harry Potter, though. Harry Potter is awesome. And they have dragons! And they're British! <laughs> what is that? I like listening to British people's voices. Oh, yeah, you know. Okay, it's I can, nice I can hear that. Yeah. But I think J.K. Rowling is a fantastic storyteller. She comes up with all these really, really cool ideas, and the whole world of Harry Potter is just amazing. She, everything she touches is, like, awesome. I love Fantastic Beasts. Uh, I love the amusement parks more than I probably should. I want to live in Universal Studios and Harry Potter World or the Wizarding World. So, yeah, there's that. Someone said they didn't want to go to fourth grade. I actually moved schools and I was moved. To, I had a new school in fourth grade. And it was okay. So you'll be fine. It's fourth grade. Uh, it's be fine. Lucy says make merch. We are working on it. So if you did see our uh, YouTube live announcement picture today. That is one of the drawings that we're working on for some merch. 
and uh, Little Froggy is designing a lot of it. I am, that's why it's taking so long. Yeah, <laughs> and uh, she's working on it all summer, and so uh, hopefully, real, real soon, we will have like t-shirts I literally and have stuff one available. more picture to do, like one more, and I'm doing it like right now, so. Yeah, real soon. <laughs> Okay, who's your BTS bias? My BTS bias is Tang. Like, y'all know that. It's like facts. <laughs> like, Tang is like the best. I mean, like, I love all of them. I do. But Tang is the best. One. Like, why do you pick just one? Because you need all of them for the group. Because it's Tang. <laughs> okay. I mean, I'm just curious. Because I just listen to, like, the music. And I'm like, okay. It's yeah, like a collective, cohesive sound. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. But, like, armies, you understand. So. They do go off and do their own songs too. Yeah, yeah, they do. Okay, so I understand that. Honestly, though, my favorite solo songs are usually like Jungkook or RM. RM does a lot of rapping. RM is a good rapper. Um, can you make a denim jacket? Yes, that is on the to do list. Can we speak Spanish? Uh, so I don't speak Spanish now or else. Um, I know how is Como. Uh, no. No hablo espanol. <laughs> Lo siento. What do you, do you know what you're saying? No, I don't speak Spanish. Oh, sorry. Okay. Uh, trying to speak Spanish, but yeah. I have, I've totally fell off my lessons, so I'm a horrible person. Um, how do you store your doll rooms? Well, if you look behind us, this is all of our Ikea doll house, Sophie and Chloe's house, that is being stored behind us on a shelf. A lot of them are also being stored on a couple of other shelves. The box rooms fold up and they go on shelves. So everything's pretty much stored on shelves, except for Sophie and Chloe's house because we have that displayed, but it's still on a shelf. So Someone said they love my crafting skills. Okay, here's the tea. So I don't actually not that good at crafting, but uh, and that bag was like really cool though because I actually, we went to Saxworth Avenue and it was like, uh, and we're getting told time. Well, I'm telling my story, so. Uh, okay. <laughs> um, uh, and we went to Saxworth Avenue and we saw all the designer stuff and literally half of the stuff in there you could just make. So, like, yeah. I don't know if half of it we can make. Probably 95%. You know. <laughs> but uh, it's always fun to go in stores and get inspiration to go out and make your own thing. And I'm glad that we had that experience and shopping. And it was a lot of fun walking around. But uh, we didn't do a lot of shopping. We, we really, didn't go in. We didn't do shopping We were mainly like, this costs how much? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's amazing. And on Instagram and like doing posts in the mirrors, looking crazy. One time we were going down an escalator and there was a mirror like on the escalator, and I didn't know that the back was like open, like for everyone to see you. So I was dancing on the escalator in front of the mirror, and everyone was looking at me. But whatever, because yep. and they're like, oh, it's those people doing, <laughs> like they don't belong in here because we don't know how to act in stores. To be honest. Apparently, <laughs> me and my brother like literally sword fight in Walmart. So yeah. Uh, make a pushy sweatshirt, absolutely. Fanny Jean, what's up? Oh, I'm sorry, Franny Jean, what's up? Okay, okay, uh, we're getting the we're getting yeah. told that we're running out of time again as soon as I am no longer super gross. So right now I'm getting over a cold, and I don't want to mail my germs out to all of you awesome people. So as soon as I'm all back to normal, we will definitely do a giveaway. We also have a possible meet and greet coming up in Atlanta this year. I think it's in November sometime. Let me get the deets about that, and I'll get back to you for our meet and greet. It's going to be with the, uh, it should be with Walmart. So just give me some time to get all of everything finalized, and, and I can tell you exactly when it's going to be and what Walmart we'll be at. Okay, and up next is... Shout outs. Here we go. We would like to give a shout out to Maria's Doll World. What's, What's up? up? Uh, Benny Bung said I'm pretty. Thank you. That's not a shout out. But yeah. Okay. I just gave him a shout out. <laughs> uh, Margarita, stop worrying about fourth grade. You'll be fine. What's up? Um, who is that? Mila Torres. What's up? Zoe Fantastic. What's up? The Sweet Doll Box. What's up? Um, strawberry milk. What's up? Uh, Kaya Federick. What's up? Colette Oqua. What's up? Purple Counselor. What's up? Um, Libby. What's up? Geeky Gray Girls. What's up? Um, Carolina Gill. What's up? Uh, 
with how do you send fan mail? If you go to our about page on YouTube, there is information on the PO box for it where you can send fan mail. Okay. Uh, Roblox. Sunflower wants to play more Roblox. Okay, absolutely. And Royal High has had an update, and we've got to get to it. We just haven't got a chance yet because we've been traveling and school and all this crazy stuff. But yes, we'll get to it as soon as we can. Okay. Make it um, Froggy Fan Room. I know. It's on my to-do list. Mom of two. What's up? Why Joel. Are you subscribing, man? Joel. <laughs> What's up? Probably because we're like crazy and all Don't that topic. Don't subscribe. <coughs> um... <laughs> Sandra Nyan, what's up? Uh, B B K Games, what's up? Um, Joelle, what's up? Salt something. It went by so fast. Okay. Uh, uh, awesome Wait. vids. What's up? Two more. Mila Torres, what's up? I did that one. I did that oh, yeah. one. Scott, what's up? Um, Josie, what's up? And Abby A, what's up? Kim this doll production, what's up? And Panda's World, what's up? Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Make sure to follow us on Instagram at my frog up and the frog blog. Make sure to subscribe to subscribe and not unsubscribe because we need subscribers. <laughs> so <laughs> and once again, we'd like to give a very special thank you to MGA for sending us Pop Pop Hair Surprise coming out this fall so that you can have fun styling your hair with fun little pets that you can take everywhere. And it's a brush. That's pretty cool. Alright, thank you so much for joining us this week on YouTube Live with the Froggies. Like I shared that part, didn't you? Yeah. Okay. Subscribe and make a Bloxburg video. Okay, I hear you. I'll do it. See you next week.